Uh, it's uh, one of the oldest organizations in the country, in, in, in uh, of Telugu origin. We started in 1991, uh, and uh, it's uh, over the last 33 years, uh, we've been doing a lot of uh, seva uh, activities in both Telangana, Andhra, as well as uh, in the United States. But first, before I get into that, you know, first I want to thank you, sir, you know, for your aggression. I know I got connected through someone via WhatsApp and you were persistent, you know, please, you know, I want, I want Arta to come to the SP University and, and do this competition and interact with our students. Uh, and I think uh, you're a great uh, asset to RUSA program and the SP University. And the students as well, you know, today, yeah, please give him a big round of applause. Uh, and uh, the students, I, I just heard that today is a holiday, actually, uh, being the Vaikuntha Ekadasi, but you are still here. That shows the dedication, uh, both from the staff and the students and the startup companies to be here and to interact with us. We are really uh, glad and uh, we are so happy to be doing this. So, you know, going back to ATA, you know, ATA was founded to act as a bridge between the Telugu people in the United States and the Telugu people here in this uh, doing both in, in uh, literary, cultural, educational and business areas. So one of the uh, you know, notable things about ATA is the business community within the organization is very strong. We have quite a few, uh, you know, uh, you know, executives that are leading the Fortune 500 companies. We have multiple startup uh, company executives who have really done well. We have multiple private equity folks in the in the uh, organization. So the business group is very strong and uh, robust. So with that, what we have done, been doing for over the 10 years is encouraging the startup uh, ecosystem both here in the uh, in, in the Telugu in India as well as in the US. So and as part of that we are conducting competitions in, in, in multiple places to encourage them to provide, provide mentoring and potentially to provide some investment as well. So we have done that you know just to, a few days ago at Andhra University you know they have something called AHAB so we have done a great competition some of them uh, came out to be really well, so there's a potential for investment there. We've been working with the T-Hub in Hyderabad for a long time. Uh, so this, you know, first time coming to SD University and uh, that I know of and working with RUSA organization. So we are excited to be associated, to associate in future uh, with us, uh, with RUSA, not only just now, this coming year for the next one hour or so, but I would like to entertain uh, and come up with some ideas on how ATA can continue to engage in a longer term basis with RUSA to provide mentoring to startup companies, potential investment to startup companies, and build an ecosystem where we can bring, uh, you know, private equity companies and other folks, and maybe potentially we can host, you know, one or two students in a, uh, in the U.S. and for some time so they can learn the ecosystem and how the system works in the U.S. So with that, that's my short uh, brief comments and uh, thank you again for being here and making us part of this event. Organization, you know, thanks to all of them coming from the U.S. You know, usually this time of the year they spend, you know, in the U.S. we have Christmas holidays. They spend time with their families but this time they have set aside their family time and came here and doing these, uh, uh, you know, different types of uh, wonderful activities, you know, including the business seminars, etc. So Satish, who is our uh, treasurer and has been a big asset to the organization. <laughs> Satish Reddy from Dallas, Texas. Kashi Kota is from Detroit. Uh, he is the board of trustee. Parmesh Bhim Reddy is the past president, he is from New Jersey. Ishwar Banda is our media chair, he is from Virginia as well. So, and, and, and all the supporting, you know, Swarupa and Srini. Can you, you know, young guy here, you know, Kais is the son, Srinivas, you want to say, uh, just introduce and say what you're doing? You're good? 
So he, he just graduated from college in the US two years ago. Pardon? Two years ago, and he is uh, working in, uh, in a general in one of the automobile companies in the Detroit area. So that's great. So thank you all.